Real quick, before we start, Pokemon Go was updated to version 0.67.2 for Android and 1.37.2 for iOS yesterday. That update should start rolling out today, and it includes bug fixes. People are reporting that a lot of the bugs with the battle system and raid boss battles have been addressed, so there's no more weird health getting restored and charge moves not working properly. So a lot of the bugs that I actually experience and talk about later on in this video should be fixed with the update. Also, the Silph Road did an APK mine of the small update and found something interesting. Small references to an anniversary event for Pokemon Go. Today is June 30th. Pokemon Go's anniversary is in one week, and it's possible that we might see this golden Pikachu that's sort of been hinted at, this rumor that's been going around. And while we don't really have any confirmed details, I think it's possible that we could be getting shiny Pikachu as part of the anniversary event. I I really thought and hoped that Gen 3 would come out around the first anniversary of the game, but I think it's still too soon after uh, the raid boss and gym update, and we might see Gen 3 later on in the summer. But all in all, great to see that Niantic has addressed those bugs, and stay tuned and enjoy the rest of the episode. Internet just went down at the apartment. It hasn't happened in a while. But now I have to head out and upload on some public Wi-Fi somewhere. So I guess it's time for breakfast. Hi, do you guys sell uh, toy machine boards? Adam said learn earth turns. I learned earth turns. What's next? Can I have a dragon's breath shot? Yeah. And a 16 ounce. I had to stop real quick by my favorite spot to get a juice and a shot. Cause I got something going on in my throat. But check this out, the last time I was in here, I was talking to the owner about Pokemon Go and he was telling me how they were trying to get a Pokestop here when the game first launched, when it was super hype. And here it is. They actually got a Pokestop of the mural inside. So I don't know if someone submitted that for them or if they submitted that, but that brings me to a good point, which is there are a lot of cars driving by. Niantic has been continually working on Operation Portal Recon, and something like 300,000 new Ingress portals have been added in the last week or two, and a lot of those are becoming Pokestops. So there's a brand new Pokestop. This is literally the first time that I've ever seen this here. That's exciting. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, this, this is good. Chance's birthday is coming up. Actually, Chance's birthday is in January, but my mom celebrates his half birthday. So we can have a party during summer, and it's not too close to Christmas. She asked me to get him a skateboard, because I guess all his friends have started skating, and he wants to learn. So of course, I'm super stoked to get Chance's first legit skateboard. All right, here it is, Chance's first skateboard. Maybe not the most um, kid-friendly graphic, but got a support toy machine. Oh, it's so small. I haven't skated a board this small in like 10 years. I gotta get home now. I got a special guest joining me in about 20 minutes. You probably already know who it is because of the thumbnail. So I'm over here on the side of the aquarium 
so I can reach this Alakazam raid. But I'm not going to go in alone on this one. I'm just going to hang out here, power up some Pokemon, and wait for someone to show up to help me. One thing I want to do right now is use my one fast TM on my Dragonite so I can get Dragon Tail. Dragonite's possible quick moves are Steel Wing and Dragon Tail, and since mine already has Steel Wing, it's a 100% chance that I'm going to get Dragon Tail out of this. And there it is. So that's Dragon Tail, Dragon Claw, a very high DPS Dragonite. I don't have any strong Dark type attackers. That's Fire Fang Fire Blast. I have Faint Attack Foul Play here. I could also power up my Gengar, but it's going to be weak to Alakazam's attacks. I'm going to do it anyway, just because it's high DPS in general. I could use it on a lot of things besides just Alakazam. Plus this is its best moveset, and it's a legacy moveset. So I'm willing to invest a Stardust into it. We found Nick. I literally, I was about to walk right past you. Yo, check it out. I got some help. Hey guys. Now it's time to battle. Are you ready to hop in on this? Yeah, let's do it. Okay, we're gonna smack this Alakazam. Two of us, we're good. Oh, oh, hold on. Oh, we have a full. I don't have a raid pass. Uh -oh. Okay. Time to make Niantic some money. Oh, gym. I don't have this gym badge either. Really? I've been down here like three times since <laughs> the update. I. I just, I forget to spin the gyms. I'm 18 in, seconds. And I'm filling up with Frolligators right now. 14 seconds. Let me set my team. Oh my. Have you not? Good. <laughs> I'm just taking DPS. Good luck. Yeah, I probably shouldn't be bringing Frolligators, but we're going to do it. So yeah, I feel I mean, like there's enough of us in here. Do we have, oh, we've got, oh. Uh, all right. I hope, what, what did you get stuck with? I set like two Pokemon. <laughs> I mean, I have my DPS Dragonite, so. Okay. As long as you got I'm that. Good. I'm good here. I'm gonna start off with a Tyranitar. Yeah. Oh, do you want to teach me how to dodge? Yes. How do you dodge correctly? Because I just spam yes. the dodge. Raid bosses don't actually give you a warning for the attack. Okay. So there's no indication when you need to dodge. So you kind of just have to like, you really do have to spam it against oh, okay. them. So you have to watch for the animation. But okay. uh, against like a regular, excuse me, bless you. Against a regular Pokemon, I can, uh, I can show you what's up. Nice. And we smack that. There we go, 61 seconds left. Okay. And you got rare candies. Oh, another charge TM. Lucky. Six rare candies. Look, what? <laughs> That's so that big. That was a good one. <laughs> Dang, okay. Oh, what? and you got the most. Wow. Team Instinct Gym came control. to play today, That's for sure. I have 13 balls. I'm Please. not I'm not going to go golden yet. Uh, there we go. I had a couple run for me yesterday, and I didn't use the golden raspberries, and I feel like it's probably a large reason why. Wow, okay. Big guy over here. First throw. That's it. There's We're heading up now to a Machamp raid this way. This will be my first Machamp raid, which is exciting because Machamp's like one of the most essential Pokemon in the game right now. We got some eggs hatching also. Not exciting so far. What'd you get? Poliwag. Nice. I mean, counter dynamic punch Poliwrath. Another Poliwag. There you go. <laughs> so, Bring the whole fan two up. potential counter dynamic punch. <laughs> Check the IVs on this one. Yeah, that's a good one. One more, two more. Hey. And Magnemite. Everything that spawns in the area you just had. It really is. That was perfect. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right. Oh, one more. One more. One possibly redeeming egg here. Yes! <laughs> that was I will take that. <laughs> HP, yep. That is a good shuffle. I've never heard those All two right. words in the same place. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the Machamp raid right up ahead, so... I might... Uh, I might need to power some stuff up for that, too. I'm going to, right now, spend even more Stardust. First, I'm going to use a Charge TM on my perfect IV Alakazam because I've been waiting so long for this. There he is. Forget Shadow Ball, learn something Psychic type, please. I'm gonna use another Charge TM on my perfect IV, Alakazam. Forget Focus Blast. Forget Focus Blast. And learn a Psychic type move, please. Forget Shadow Ball. Learn a Psychic type move. I'm gonna use all, I'll use them all. Oh my God, all right. How about this time? 
Yeah, I'll let you know. Okay. I'll let you know when all my charge TMs are gone. There we go, future sight with one TM left. And now real quick, I gotta spend the Stardust to power them up. I cannot believe I just used almost all my charge TMs on that. Uh, this probably isn't the best time to realize this, but I don't think I should be investing this much Stardust into Alakazam right now. Especially since it's not a great meta counter. It's good DPS overall, like top three DPS. But there are other, maybe more important Pokemon that I could spend this on. And I still think that Gen 3 is coming before the end of the summer. Possibly even at the one year anniversary in like, well, that's like a week from now. So we'll see. But uh, I should probably save the rest of this Stardust. Sure, I'm gonna stop there. We're going in. I think it's just the two of us, but that's that's honestly no problem against him a champ. Give me that Alakazam, Gengar, good high DPS. Let's see how this goes. I'm probably gonna try to dodge. Well, you should always try to dodge the charge moves from the raid bosses because oh that damage is heavy. And Alakazam has very low defense. Oh, I missed it. I missed the dodge. That was the most important dodge of the entire day, and I missed it. Alright, here we go. It's just DPS now. Look at that. I'm chunking him. I mean, I know there's other people helping, but... Uh... There we go. I got some HP back there. The close combat animation is tricky because the animation starts and the damage follows very quickly after. So without that warning flash, it's it's hard to time a dodge against a raid boss Machamp. Whoa. I just glitched really badly. The Machamp's going back to full health. All right, I'm not contributing anything for the rest of this battle, probably, because I'm stuck in this infinite glitch loop. And someone on Reddit figured something out here. It seems like what happens is the game tries to replay your last battle. So you get stuck in these weird loops, but if you restart the game between gym battles or between raid bosses, usually that won't happen. So until this gets fixed, that might be your best bet. Just restart the game after every battle before you start another one. Otherwise you get the glitches like this. Is that its real HP? It might be really close to dying here. I think we did it. No? So close. It's so close. We can do this one of two ways. There we go. We got it. We got it. Golden raspberries, revives. No TMs to replenish my suffering supply. 10 balls, that's fine. That's plenty. If I get a good IV Machamp out of it, I'm fine. I'm fine with the glitches, I'm fine with using all the TMs. If I can get another good Machamp right here. Oh, that's a bad throw. It's a good day for raid boss catches. Bullet punch heavy slam. So the move's already not good. The IVs are not great either. Seasonal. It's the actual podium. Oh, that's a that's a great end clip. Oh this is the podium gym for the Grand Prix. You're actually standing in my spot. My trainer tips car, Alvaro Parent, stood right there after the Long Beach Grand Prix. And my logo's still on that car, so shout out to K-Pax Racing. Go check them out. Support them throughout the rest of this season. But we got a Jolteon right here. We're going in. I'm almost going in. Gotta buy another raid pass. Here we go. Two minute countdown. Look at that. That's all I need right there. Ride on, ride on, ride on. Nah, dude. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Look at that. That Thunderbolt barely does anything to ride on because of its immunity. 50% damage from electric type attacks. Dragonite. This is just DPS at this point. I think Mystic's got it. Yep. Look at that. Two Dragonites. That's maybe that's a weird angle. Oh, his has Dragon Breath though. The DPS is better on Dragon Tail, but I like Dragon Breath better because it's faster. And faster attacks give you better dodging opportunities. 
and I'm a big Dodger. Not a Dodgers fan, but a big Dodger. So here we go. Let's see what we get. 15, 22, four revives, 10 rare candies. I'm fine with 10 rare candies. All right, GG, Nick. Well played. Wow. Well played. I'll knock you up on that. Have you got yours yet? Still working on it. Oh boy, are you going raspberry? No, nah, this is a regular raspberry. I really enjoy your throw technique. Just the way you make the ball like stay there and spin. I've always seen that and been like, that is Thank cool you. stuff. Thank you. Let's see it. You have the mystic magic? All right, uh. suck. <laughs> nope. There we go. Great throw. If this doesn't hit, I have two balls left and I'm going for the golden red. Oh, critical catch. That works too. Now let's check the IVs. Volt switch Thunderbolt. That's a good defensive move set. HP, really strong. Cool. We got it. But here it is. The winner. About to take the podium. I did it for my team. Second place here. That's a hey, nothing one with silver. GG's. So I just. Woke up from a nap to some pretty good news. Pokemon Go is being updated to version 0.67.2 for Android and 1.37.2 for iOS to implement bug fixes. Hopefully that includes bugs like the one we talked about earlier where gyms sort of replay your last battle unless you close the game out. Bugs like that infinite switching glitch. Bugs like not being able to add a Pokemon to a gym immediately after a teammate adds a Pokemon to that gym. There are a lot of bugs in the current version, and I'm hoping that most of them get addressed with this update. Anyway, um, I think that's probably going to be it for this video. I'm going to head out and get some more juice. Try to knock this, whatever this is, cold out before I head out for the weekend. Going to Joshua Tree. Expect an exciting video on Monday. Thanks for watching guys. I'll see you then.